Hi, welcome to Win Foundation. Win Foundation is a non-profit organization with primary operations in India. Win Foundation has a vision to support innovations in the areas of water and sanitation and maternal and child health to empower and improve the lives of underprivileged sections in a sustainable and scalable manner. Let us hear from Mr. Pareshwara, Director, India Operations on malnutrition problem in India and Win Foundation's approach to address the problem. Win Foundation nutrition projects take a local market creation approach for sustainable nutrition for community with focus on pregnant and lactating mothers, infant children and adolescent girls amongst urban slums, rural and tribal areas. Malnutrition remains a serious problem affecting women and children in India. In spite of large-scale programs by government and private charities, few important indicators in the NFHS 5 tell a worrying story. Increased percentage stunting among children in 13 out of the 22 states and union territories surveyed. Increased percentage wasting among children below 5 in 12 out of the 22 states and union territories surveyed. The existing supply-based programs do not lead to long-term habit formation among communities for healthy diets. Win Foundation Nutrition Projects aim to reduce malnutrition through a sustainable local market creation achieved using a simultaneous dual approach that is one which is pull or demand and two push or supply for the nutritious food. For demand or pull for nutritious food, we train the women field health workers on mother and child nutrition based on the first thousand days concept. The trained health workers in turn counsel mothers and communities for nutrition and hygiene and track children growth. Community health fairs and seminars are used for more awareness to generate further demand for nutritious food. The push factor that is supply of nutritious food is equally important to counter the impact of popular cheap junk foods. For this we train and support women led micro enterprises to make and market nutritious food to the community with focus on local ingredients and local products for the desired nutrition. This dual approach with women ownership and leadership generates awareness, interest, action and habit formation within the community for long term and sustainable nutrition outcomes. Women comprise half of India's human resources under key agents of sustainable development with pivotal role in the family as well as in economic development and social transformation. Win Nutrition Project harness the excellent socializing and empathizing skills of women into entrepreneurial initiatives in this critical area of nutrition. Over the span of four years, Win Foundation has launched nutrition projects in five areas with the help of NGO partners covering a total population of about one lakh. Over 100 women micro entrepreneurs organized across over 30 micro entrepreneurship teams are at different stages of training and implementation. More than eight of these groups have already started marketing their products, creating their own brand and packaging in the process. Over 350 women are also creating their nutri garden to provide better nutrition to their family with potential for micro entrepreneurship. How do we take this approach to the grassroots and make nutrition a habit for the community. For creating and supporting women micro entrepreneurs or more aptly women entrepreneurs, Win Foundation has adopted a unique multi stakeholder process. The local NGO partners support select potential interested micro entrepreneurs from the community. Our micro entrepreneurship training expert, with the help of NGO partner, trains and support them at all stages of business, including market study, product development, supply chain, production, packaging, quality control, regulatory approvals, sales, marketing, branding, finance, HR, etc. at regular intervals over 18 months. Our nutrition partner, Nutrition Group IIT Bombay, provides nutrition expertise analyzing recipes for nutrition content, 
identify gaps and measures to overcome the gaps, preferably through local natural ingredients. Wind Foundation provides support for seed fund and central kitchen facility and also manages the multi-stakeholder coordination and outcome monitoring. In rural and tribal areas, kitchen nutri garden is promoted for healthy ingredients apart from using them for home consumption, providing opportunity for women micro-entrepreneurship additional income. The role of our partners is critical in our multi-stakeholder approach. Let us hear from our implementing NGO partner, Ms. Rajul Bharti, CEO of Summer Charitable Trust, talking about WIN-sponsored nutrition project and its impact. We initiated a partnership with WIN Foundation in the year 2020 and started working with 35 women from rural areas of Sanand, Ahmedabad. These women were women who had earlier worked as agricultural labourers or cattle rearers, but had never worked out of their homes. And here, they were trained as micro-entrepreneurs. They were trained in financial planning, in business development, in WhatsApp business strategies, in making a business plan of their own. And finally, 12 of these women started their enterprises. These women were later also trained in understanding nutrition, understanding carbohydrates, requirements of fats, proteins, vitamins in their body. And therefore, they started their enterprises of making nutritive snacks. These were snacks provided for the communities of their area, for their own people, for the children going to school, for women of Anganwadis. In this endeavor, they were supported by Sitara, Center for Technology Alternatives for Rural Areas, from IIT Mumbai. This support helped them improve the nutritive content of their food products. Thus, these women are now getting gainful employment by providing nutritive snacks not only for their community but also for the larger area of Ahmedabad. How do we take these women on their journey towards micro-entrepreneurship? The women micro-entrepreneurs require extensive training and hand-holding provided by our professional micro-entrepreneurship trainer. Let us hear from Mr. Nikesh Ingle, a certified master trainer on women micro-entrepreneurship training. So it started with interaction with various villagers, the teams, forming the teams and then understanding what they want to do, how much uh, entrepreneurial activities they can have. And the rigorous training has uh, pivoted them into uh, micro-entrepreneurs. First, they, it started with uh, understanding the product, what product they want to make, how the nutrition can be added to it. And they have gone through various challenges, they learned through various challenges, in between COVID also came. But uh, earlier they were very shy uh, to go to the market, but now they are selling their own product. Even they are selling their product on, uh, on digital platforms and now is the condition that they have their own brand. The branding and packaging and everything is done by them at very local level and in in this process more than 100 uh, direct and indirect nutrients are created this is still going on <laughs> The training introduces business and entrepreneurship to the women micro entrepreneur candidates and then takes them through all aspects of business with practice oriented small steps at each stage where the women learn by doing and become committed entrepreneurs. <laughs>
The central kitchen for each project provides the women micro entrepreneur space to prepare food in hygiene manner and pack the same, store ingredients and finished product in safe manner and also do safe packaging. They also get regular training and enable peer discussions and try new products using different recipes for varying nutrition, taste and pricing objectives. It will also enable them to plan for certification as their volume grows. In short, it is a place they can proudly call as their own. The women nutripreneurs also imbibe branding and marketing lessons by practice with their products and ventures in the field, gaining competency and expertise at the same time. Thus, the nutripreneur ventures continuously strive for higher maturity levels. To enable women nutripreneurs extend their reach, Right from their home or workplace, we also train them on digital business through a training on WhatsApp for business. More than 40 micro entrepreneurs participated from diverse locations. The micro entrepreneurs implemented their WhatsApp for business pages and started generating business through digital means. Felicitation function helped to bring them together and interact on a common platform. Let us hear from Shanila Banu, our nutripreneur on digital training. Kitchen Nutri Gardens provide women a great potential to use their small patches of land around the house to grow vegetables, fruits and herbs. This can uplift the nutrition profile of the family with potential to market the surplus. Win Foundation Nutri Garden projects include training the women on number one, growing a variety of local and useful plants with maximum natural inputs, number two, nutrition content of plants, recipes and ways to enhance mother and child nutrition. Ongoing support and updates are also provided. As women become more proficient, further training will aim to make them nutripreneurs to market their surplus output, either primary product or food product. Let us hear from Ms. Rajul Bharati, CEO of Summer Charitable Trust, our partner on our joint project with 357 women of 33 SD groups covering 21 villages and 12 hamlets located in the Kutch district of Gujarat. The Nutri Kitchen Garden project is based in Rapar, Kutch, Gujarat. 30% of the population is from extremely marginalized groups. And among these groups, women and children are the most vulnerable population. Their staple diet is root vegetables, pulses, etc. with no access to green leafy vegetables. The project aims at reaching 350 women by supporting them to grow green leafy vegetables in their backyard. The support will be given by helping them to procure organic seeds and technical knowledge on how to grow in these dry and arid conditions. It is hoped that through this project, we will reach a population of about 2000 people, especially women and children, and help them focus on their nutritional health. Now, we listen to Ms. Hiraben Gadvi from Arid Communities and Technologies, who leads Another group of 75 women in the Mandvi Taluka in Kutch district of Gujarat. Namaste. I want to tell you about some of the nutrition garden here. The women who have done this very well. The women who have done the water from the west of the kitchen, they have also made their food. And the women who have done their farm, they have also made their food in their farm. उसने बहुत अच्छे से न्यूट्रिशन गार्डन बनाया है जिससे उसके घर की ताज़ी ताज़ी सब्जियां उसे मिल जाती है और उसकी सेहत के लिए भी अच्छा है जो मार्केट से एक तो बासी और दूसरी दवाइयों से पकी हुई दवा होती है सब्जियां उन सब से छुटकारा ले लिया है और उसने खुद अपनी ही फार्मल अपनी ही खेती में वो ताज़ी ताज़ी सब्जियाँ उगाते हैं जो खुद के सेहत के लिए बहुत अच्छी है द न्यूट्रिपिन ट्रेनिंग हैज क्रिएटेड न्यू पॉसिबिलिटीज इन द माइंड ऑफ दिस वुमेन एंड ब्रिंग्स आउट देर नेटिव इंटेलिजेंस creativity and innate business sense. They create sustainable enterprises to provide nutrition to their communities and other customers. The Nutri Garden project empowers the local women including landlords with training and support to make them nutrition champions for the communities. These women gain new respect in their family and social circles. 
we have seen how the supply or push is addressed so now how do we complete the local market cycle by simultaneously creating sustained demand or pull for nutrition there is widespread lack of awareness on health and hygiene among poor communities the government has created an excellent system of asha workers and anganwadi workers our field health worker training aims at continuous updates and motivation to ensure effective counseling this training is based on first 1000 days concept starting from conception of the child including mother's nutrition the newborn nutrition by mother's breastfeeding and subsequently additional food up to about 2 years of age of the infant child This 3 days training program has been developed by Dr. Rupal Dalal, Director SMDT Trust and Adjunct Faculty of Nutrition Group at IIT Bombay. Learning materials include health charts, models and health videos which are also distributed to each learner for their use later. The trained field health workers are then motivated to counsel mothers on nutrition and hygiene and track infant child growth and illness the iit bombay health spoken tutorial cover was number of topics on nutrition and are very easy to understand win foundation has sponsored several health spoken tutorials they are available in multiple indian languages on an open source basis they can be used for training self learning and counseling at all levels let us see glimpse of practical training sessions organized by win foundation for health workers dr rupal dalal giving online training on cross cradle holding breastfeeding techniques isme kya hota hai ki bahut time मदर जो है यहाँ पे बरोबर मतलब बगल में नहीं डालती है मतलब वो उसका बच्चा है थोड़ा थोड़ा धीरे धीरे करके वो नीचे आ जाता है ठीक हेल्थ वर्कर्स इन ए ट्रेनिंग सेशन लर्निंग बाय प्रैक्टिसिंग आयरन खून के लिए लगता है तो विटामिन ए आंखों के लिए लगता है तो सारे फंक्शनल बोलते हैं उसको और जो टाइप टू है वो पूरा ग्रोथ न्यूट्रेंट है पूरे ग्रोथ के लिए तो टाइप टू न्यूट्रेंट कौन से कौन से है प्रोटीन वसा वीडियो to teach them on child health nutrition the field health worker is a crucial link to reach to the mothers and counseling her and other family members regularly on nutrition and hygiene using the print and video materials made available they also track growth of infant children and in case of any chronic or acute problems connect them to the local public health centers or hospitals this is critical to ensure mental and physical growth among infant children we are happy and proud to mention that health department ahmedabad municipal corporation government of gujarat felicitated win foundation on world breastfeeding week celebration day for its support and contribution in the mc mother and child nutrition effort let us hear mr pareshwara summarize winning against malnutrition it is indeed very heartening to see the women nutripreneurs take ownership and leadership in this fight against malnutrition through the win nutrition projects win projects bring multiple stakeholders together to support the women nutripreneurs the innovations in nutrition recipes and food testing from iit bombay nutrition group with close involvement of faculty and phd scholars help bring science to society the micro entrepreneurship training helps women to learn business skills including quality product development brand building and even digital marketing amongst others the nutri gardens allow women to learn smart gardening as well as nutrition science to bring back food diversity and greater 
nutrition to the family table, the training of field health workers with effective print and electronic guides allow these workers to be more effective in the counseling of mothers for nutrition and hygiene. These innovative approaches enable the women to take center stage in fighting malnutrition in our communities and the country. This showcases the impact of taking society to science. Win Foundation and its partners and even more so the women nutripreneurs are confident of this Atmanirbhar and sustainable approach towards tackling malnutrition. This film is our tribute to the women nutripreneurs, our partners and the communities which have supported them. It is also a call to action for all of us.